प्रवक्ता हिमानी कोष ऑस्ट्रेलिया बाजार आज हम पेट्रन बड़ा महारानी कोमल राज्य लक्ष्मी देवी शाह सरकार को शुभ जन्म उत्सव में आईदी भाई यहाँ सब मस्त हिमानी कोष ऑस्ट्रेलिया टीम बाई स्वागत कर धन्यवाद टकराव चाहिए Damilia, this is uh, welcome. I hope you do understand it. Hamro program agadi bordo ag banda pahile. Mo I would like to acknowledge the traditional owners of the land on which we are meeting today. Pay my respects to their elders, past and present, and the Aboriginal elders of the other communities who may be here today. अब मोचे अलग तो हाउस रूल्स यार ले बने चु। First, I'd like to invite Jamilia, please, to come and get this recognition, a small token from us. Uh, so this is our traditional culture. It's uh, this kind of performance as well. This is the place that the first thing is made in the world. This is the आज फिर भी नहीं समझ रहा नहीं नमस्ते आज फिर भी नहीं सिंचो अपॉलिजीज़ आज टेक्निकल डिफिकल्टीज़ तो प्रेड करने साथ ही ना आगे देखिए प्रिपेयर तो करे रहे को तो अपनी हैके टाइम पर स्टार्ट रहे कि यू आ वी हैव टेक्निकल डिफिकल्टीज़ आ सब इस आना है गुड मॉर्निंग और फिर भी नहीं नमस्कार मेरा नाम रेशमा था का हाल ही मैंने कुछ ऑस्ट्रेलिया के जनरल सेक्रेटरी में जो कार्यक्रम अगर नहीं बड़ा नहीं बना अगर नहीं आई वुड लाइक टू एक्नॉलेज ट्रेडिशनल ओनर ऑफ़ द लैंड वी स्टैंड टुडे आई वुड लाइक टू एक्नॉलेज द गैडिबो पीपल ऑफ़ द इयोरा हम लोग छोटे समय में अपन जनासी टाइगर के लिए आए दिन भाई तो हम लोग हम लोग भी कैसे आए आज वो लाइक देरे देरे करने बात अन्य यानों की बात होती है अभी बाद है स्पेशली हम लोग नंबर बुरुल जो अन्य मामले को भी दायित्व बना रहे थे तो एनआरएनी प्रेसिडेंट हम लोग छुट्टी दी दी एनएसडब्ल्यूडी डिप्ल Jamila Talib Gabriela, Ms. Uh, Mrs. Deb Jamila Gabriela, uh, Vice Ambassador for Women's and Children's Center in Sarajevo, Bosnia, and in Herzegovina, Vice uh, Police Commissioner, Multicultural Advis Advisory Council, and Stubb Republican Member of the UN Women uh, Council Australia, and the government. 
फेरी पनि हजुरहरुलाई हार्दिक ज्ञान अभिवादन अनि स्वागत गर्न चाहन्छु म हिमाली कोस अस्ट्रेलियाको तर्फबाट र हाम्रो जुम मासिक पनि आउँदै हुनुहुन्छ उहाँहरु जोइन भइरहनु भएको छ उहाँहरुलाई पनि हाम्रो विभिन्न इन्डस्ट्रीमा पनि मेम्बरहरु रहनु भएको छ उहाँहरु जुन जोइन गर्नुहुन्छ भन्ने आशा छ र उहाँलाई पनि धेरै नै स्वागत गर्न चाहन्छु यसका साथै हिमाली कोस परिवार र मिडिया सहकर्मीहरू र हाम्रो नेपाली समुदायको विभिन्न क्षेत्रमा काम गर्ने साथीहरू यहाँ सहभागी हुनु भइदिनु भएकोमा धेरै धेरै धन्यवाद हजुरको साथ र सहयोगी हामी आज तिन वर्ष भयो हामी भर्खर पाइला चालिरहेका छौँ हजुरहरूको साथ र सहयोग नभएको भए हामी अब यसरी नेपाली समुदायमा चाहिँ काम गर्न सक्दैन थियो तर हजुरको साथ सहयोग मार्गदर्शनले गर्दा हजुरले को साथ पाएर नै हामी आज यो कार्यक्रम पनि गर्न सक्नु भएको छौँ आजको कार्यक्रमको बारेमा थोरै भन्नु पर्दा आज श्री पाँच बडा महारानी कुमुल राज्य लक्ष्मी देवी शाह सरकारको बहत्तरौँ जन्मोत्सव को उपलक्ष्यमा हामीले फन्ड रेजिङ कार्यक्रम गर्न गइरहेका छौँ आज फन्ड रेजिङ चाहिँ अस्तिदेखि इनिसिएट भइसकेको छ र आज चाहिँ हाम्रो अन्तिम दिन आज जति पनि रकम उठ्छ त्यो चाहिँ हामी नेपालमा सय प्रतिशत नै हामी उहाँलाई दिनेछौँ उहाँलाई हस्तान्तरण गर्नेछौँ र यसै भन्दै गर्दा म चाहिँ हाम्रो मौसुम सरकारलाई पनि जनोत्सवको हार्दिक मगनमय शुभकामना व्यक्त गर्न चाहन्छु उहाँको दीर्घायु सुस्वास्थ्यको पनि कामना गर्न चाहन्छु म उहाँ चाहिँ हाम्रो हिमाली क्रस नेपालको प्याटर्न पनि भइ बस्छ भनेपछि हाम्रो त अभिभावक हाम्रो मार्गदर्शन गर्ने गर्दा त्यसैले पनि आज चाहिँ उहाँको बहत्तरौँ एउटा माइलस्टोन जन्मदिन चाहिँ हामी मनाइरहेको छ त्यो पनि फन्ड रेस कार्यक्रम फन्ड रेस केका लागि भन्दा हाम्रो एक्सेस टु क्लिन ड्रिङ्किङ वाटर प्रोजेक्ट जसले चाहिँ दस हजार बाल बालिका बाढी प्रभावित र पिछडिएका बाल बालिकाहरूले चाहिँ स्वच्छ खाने पिउने पानीको एक्सेस पाउनु भनेर चाहिँ हाम्रो यो प्रोजेक्टमा सपोर्ट गरिरहेका छौँ किम यहाँहरूलाई भन्ने जति हामीले बुझाउन सक्थ्यौँ आजको रेशमाजीले एकदम क्लियरली बुझाइदिनु भयो किनभने हाम्रो यो इभेन्ट चाहिँ नै जन्म उत्सवको साथ साथै फन्ड रेजिङको लागि हो र फन्ड रेजिङ इज फर वाटर भेरी भाइटल फर लिभिङ र सानो सानो बच्चाहरूको लागि हो अब हामी चाहिँ हजुरहरू हाम्रो रेगुलर गेस्टहरूले आएर यसो एक दुई शब्दहरूलाई बोलिदिनु भयो भने चाहिँ वी विल बी रियली ग्रेटफुल सो सबैभन्दा पहिले जहाँ पनि लेडिज फर्स्ट हुन्छ सो सुकृति भट्टज्यू हजुर अगाडि आएर प्लिज सेयर फिल्म भयो very much. Uh, namaste and a very good afternoon. Firstly, I would like to acknowledge the traditional owners of the land that we are meeting today. Pay my respects to elders past, present and emerging. Today also falls the most auspicious occasions of Mahashivaratri. I extend my best wishes to all Nepalis and who follow the Sanatana Dharma. Do everything to obstruct them from seeking that education. Waterborne diseases, we all know, is a very common issue that results in the children's absence from seeking and accessing that education. And it's definitely a step to ensure that the education to seamless and is action is aimed towards achieving quality outcomes is by tackling and providing that self, um, you know, access to that safe drinking water. Again, um, today I would like to wish Humani Trust the very best in RNA New South Wales that I represent because I am the deputy coordinator of the New South Wales chapter of NRNA Australia. I will say that we will always be very optimistic in helping this in this initiative in any way we can. Once again, thank you very much for having me here and I wish you the very best. Thank you very much. I will go to Thank you. Good afternoon. First of all, there is so little new date. It wasn't one hour, was it? <laughs> anyway. Grateful, <coughs> sorry, very grateful for being invited as a chief guest of this special program today, Imani Kosan uh, Thank you, Chairperson Anjana Bani, the rest of the uh, team. Uh, it's always privileged to be in a program like this. I know, I know you started three years ago and uh, I've been invited to every program and uh, I've been participating in every occasion. Uh, the special moment was, I think it was last year, when actually our former princess Imani came to Australia. We celebrated 
we did fundraising together in the Parliament House of New South Wales. That was a fantastic program. When I, I was there, and I had an opportunity to say a few things at the time, and I said, I will never forget that moment in my life. That was historic moment. So thank you again. Uh, chairperson of the program again, uh, Jamelia, special guest, uh, deputy coordinator of New South Wales and Ireland Australia, everybody here. Um, yeah, what a timing. It's a special occasion. I would like to wish a uh, happy birthday to our former queen, Kumar Raja Lakshmi Devi Sahar. May her be I know Himani Coast Australia and Himani Coast, sorry, Himani Trust of Nepal, doing a wonderful job. Uh, the project for this, what I said, like, Queen drinking water for the children. As our deputy said, it's a basic right of people, especially children, education. And we don't have that. 21st century of Nepal. So many political changes, so many leaders. Then we are we have to do this. There's no shortage of money in Nepal. It's just the drive, motivation, people don't have it. That's very unfortunate. You saw that a few days ago in the Gungabu bus park. Lawlessness. Corruptions. I don't know, it's at the peak now. Everywhere. Very disappointing. I know, we left the country. Not by choice. I think we were driven out of the country, to, out of the country, by this political system here. Political leaders, all the corrupted people. Everybody I see in Nepal, 99% of them has some sort of smell for corruption. It's a huge issue. I did write in my Facebook page a few weeks ago. Even though I had to agree with the decision of the Supreme Court, I have reservations. I don't know. It's a huge issue. There's so much frustration. All the youths are going, going out of country. 2,500. Either in the student visa or work visa to the Gulf countries or Malaysia. Who created this, this environment? Success governments, civil servants, even police. Now the big body of this structure, this system is judiciary system, and I believe they are also corrupted, everywhere. It's a huge issue. I want to go back to Nepal and do something. Well, I mean, it's scary as well. Being in this room and saying something is easy, but going over there and doing this, doing something is not easy because everyone will pounce on you. You saw that. One incident in what well, whatever Ravi Lamisan said. I agree with most of his what he said. Very, very frustrating. Worried where our country is heading. The thing is, there are people like us, you and me, the hundreds of other charity organizations. We want to do something for poor people, uneducated people. Uh, people seeking help, people with issues. As I said, there are no shortage of money in Nepal. It's not in, they haven't put the money in the right place, that's all. It's not, not been channeled into the right direction, right place. That's the problem. Otherwise, you and me you wouldn't have to do this. But now I'm happy to do this. Happy to be participating in every event you do. That's my commitment, whether I'm in or not. I have about four or five months left now, even after that, because I've been doing this for since 1996. Since the day when I landed in Australia, actually 1995. When I came to Australia in 1995, there was an incident. Well, first day, very first day, October 29, 1995. There was a dozen program organized by GNC. Even though I didn't participate, as a dancer or whatever, 
as one of the ticket buyers. Very first day. That's when I started. Him. So I'm always involved, especially in New South Wales, because you cannot be everywhere. But in Australia, we have been doing Nepal Festival. Uh, we started last year in September in Melbourne. Uh, well, before that, it was in Darwin. So we, we've done in six places now. So we have one in Adelaide and again in Darwin. I go everywhere. I can see all the people are frustrated. Because we can see what's happening in our country and we are powerless and helpless. But that's not the main issue today, I know. Yeah, we, we are here today to celebrate our birthday and also make some, well, raise some funds for the trust so the children can get clean drinking water. So from my, commitment, my side, I'll make some commitment and as, as I did last year. So thank you again. Very, very sincere apology again for being late. Thank you so much. Enlightening speech and sharing your journey and involvement with the Nepalese community here in Australia. Very much appreciated. Thank you. And now I would like to invite Amelia up on stage here, please. And uh, if you could tell us a little bit about your journey and your involvement with Manikosh. Thank you. here to celebrate the birthday of Queen Kamal of Nepal. This is a big thing, big day, not only for the Queen, but also, also for all of us here. Can I have one please, Blas? It's very hot, isn't it? <laughs> well, now you can see why it's important to have uh, charity foundations, Himani Kosh, because without this glass of water, children, they can't survive. That's very sad to hear that, but that's how it is. We couldn't survive not even 10 minutes. We so hot and asking for a glass of water. Please spread the word to your community, to your kids, through your social media. How important it is, instead of paying one cup of cup coffee outside, which costs $5.50, how much means the children in Nepal? That saved their life. Well, observing the life of Queen Komao, we can't find ourselves, because in every part of her life, Queen Kamal has shown us by her example how to bear life adversities in a, in a dignified manner. She is a wife, a mother, and a queen, but also a patronage. And she is not the queen only to the country, she is the queen to the Nepalese children. All this is woven in her work. Studying her life, I realized how many similarities there are in all women. The strength of character, the fight for our people, tradition and culture can never be destroyed in us. Even today, when I listen how lovely you speak your language, it's like a music to my ears. Staying with her people, the people of Nepal, sharing the hardship of the tragic loss of part of her family, not giving up in the fight for a better tomorrow, for the children, for the country of Nepal. Queen Komal has shown us by personal example, how to stand up proudly and not show weakness, 
than the most vulnerable. She has devoted her life to the country of Nepal, to the children, to people, to families in Nepal. Why I am in front on your stage today here? Who I am? Well, simply I'm Jimila Gabriel, former refugee from Bosnia and Herzegovina. I survived genocide, I survived war and ethnic cleansing in my country. I admire women and gentlemen as well. <laughs> like each and every one of you here, that's the reason why I did not say any special names, because we all special here today. Each person, even the youngest one, thank you very much for this lovely present. Because each of us is a special woman, special mother, and queen of her family. Today we celebrate the birthday of Queen Komal of Nepal together as a bond between women in power with dignity and pride. Now is the time for celebrations. Please allow me to propose two toasts. I propose a toast to help of each and every person here today, to your families and to all Nepalese people. I propose a toast to Himani Kosh Australia and to the health and success of Her Majesty Queen Komal. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Amelia, for that eloquent, expressive speech and emphasizing on the goal and vision of Himani Kosh. Thank you very much. Himani Kosh ma hami office bearers by hamro ekdom competent advisors pani ononcha. Just let me hamlay dheri soyo garna ononcha Himani Kosh lay agadi garna hamlay mar budarshan garna. Rahamro aja. Hami, uh, among us, there is uh, one of our advisors present, Sailesh Raj Bhandariji. Agari Aira, Hamani Mani Kosh Kabare Mali Kata Kandi Nora, please. It was an important but I always good afternoon, everyone. I'm sure a few of you had a better things to do, but you are here today. Thank you for that. First of all, um, happy birthday to you, Kavasi. <clears throat> um, I don't know if you guys bought this paper or not at the end. I know why Mr. Nandaji is late today. It says over there, whoever comes to last, we donate the most. <laughs> Sometimes, somewhere, whenever you are out of your country, you never forget your home. Never. Regardless of irrelevant of what it is, how it is. Cool is my name. And irrelevant of the cause that we are here, we always have that love for our motherland and we always try in our small ways to help. And especially coming from a country like Nepal where Abahamro, Himani Koshma, Arupani office bearers Anuta, whose contribution is a lot. And I do not want to miss uh, our treasurer Paru Pandeju. Paru, can you please come and put your views and uh, Say something to the guests about Imani Kosh. Thank you so much, Spokesperson Yu. I think uh, our uh, General Secretary has already said a lot about uh, most of the things about our project, which is clean drinking water for each and every Nepalese children. Yes, Nepal is the second in the world that has got drinking water source after Brazil. However, due to the infrastructure, due to the calamities that happen, climate calamities that happen from every now and then, and due to lack of resource, again, as our, uh, in our president advised, 
due to our political parties, today's current political parties. She's still, still the queen in our heart and she hasn't you know, looked back. She's not sitting there doing nothing. She's still contributing. The contribution that comes from her and from all the royal family, it's with us, with each and every Nepali. I'm sure every Nepali is grateful because we have our royal family, we have Nepal. We don't have our royal family. I don't know what the future will hold for Nepal and Nepali. We're all proud to say we're Nepali, but what are we doing? In saying that, I just want to say a few words to Her Majesty. This is a small word I get from the internet. I'm not specialized in Sanskrit. I'm Sanskrit to begin with Haina. But I'm going to say that I'm Sanskrit to Amma. I'm going to say that I'm going to say that I'm going to Dinatawa Pavat Mangalam Janma Divas Divam Chiranjivi Kuru Kirti Bartanam Chiranjiva Kuru Purnia Bartanam Vijay Pavatu Sarva Prasarvada Jarati Pavatu Yeshaganam. That is my wish to Her Majesty Komal Raja Lakshmi Shahadev. We would like to be under her shade for a very long period, for hundreds of years. That's all I wanted to do. Now, here comes my treasurer part. She's a very, very newcomer and the youngest uh, member of our team. Let's give her an opportunity. So, Manisha, please, can you come up here and say a few words? Pilaharusa, Ogadi Bornison, Eti Bazakasa, 
मेरा ये शब्द यही तो माहु धन्यवाद सब भाई जीरे खुर्सानी धीरे तीखो अरे मनीषा जी को कुरा सुंदा तस्त लगे बट इट वॉज हार्ट टचिंग इट मई मी चीर फुल रियली जनिलिया वॉट आई जस्ट सैड इज इन नेपाली वी हेव सेंग दैट द स्मॉलेस्ट चिली इज द मोस्ट स्पाइसी सो शी इज द यंगेस्ट एंड द वे शी सेड वॉज वंडरफुल थैंक यू सो मच बहुत अच्छा से So first of all, I just make it very short. Camera guys, please take good pictures. I need for the socials. Yeah. <laughs> like let me just start by a very warm welcome to everyone. I'm Shikhar Dikari. See you at Farm Mojimas. Thank you so much, Iman, for Australia and especially Abdul Nadizu for providing me this opportunity, this privilege to be around such wonderful people. Uh, let me start with happy 72nd birthday to Her Majesty Queen Kumara Raja Prasmi Devi Shah. Now let's just get inside what I really thought about uh, Himalayan Coast Australia and this project that's been going on for quite quite some time now. Understanding and accepting. Hazaru, sab pehle thank you first of all. Hazaru, is the photo samay ma pani hazaru isay ay boxi ba hamro. निमंत्रण एक्सेप्ट कर हमी भबजा दुटा सुटकेस बोक हम अस्ट्रेलिया आया हूं अलग एक सौ छा संस्था में बस तर यजना बीच भी हम सब भाग ठूल एनआरएनए प्रेसिडेन्ट नंद गुरुंगजी आई बसिया धीरे धीरे धन्यवाद हम डेपुटी एनआरएनए कोडिनेटर हुमन लीडर्स एज वेल सुकृति भट्टजी आई बसिया धीरे धीरे धन्यवाद हम डेमिले आई बसिया धीरे धीरे धन्यवाद अब मेरो यो वोट अफ थैंक्स सुरू करना चाहिए ऑन द ऑस्पिशियस ओकेजन्स अफ हर मेजेस्टी क्वीन कोमल राज्यलक्ष्मी देवी शाह सखार बर्थडे Before we start, I would like to acknowledge the traditional custodians of the land on which we meet today, and pay my respects to elders, past, present, and futures. I would also like to acknowledge any Aboriginals and Torres Strait Islander people with us today. Sarvapratham, Sri Pans, Bada Maharani. कोमल राज्य लक्ष्मी देवी शाह सरकार को शुभ जन्मोत्सव को पावन अवसर में सरकार को सुस्वास्थ्य दीर्घायु तथा सुख समृद्धि को मसूद सरकार बिंती चढ़ाऊ इट इज एन ऑनर टू हेव सच डिस्टिंग गेस्ट फ्रॉम द स्नेपलिस डायस्पोरा कम्युनिटी लीडर्स एंड डिग्नेटरीज and we really appreciate your support we are gathered here today for a very noble cause that is to support children with limited or no access to water with access to self drinking water in the form of self filled rations bottles with generous support from friends and families from the nepalese and australian communities We have already been able to support 3,500 children. We are exceedingly grateful and recognize immense support from bottom of my heart and on behalf of Himani Coast Australia. I would like to extend my grat gratitude to NRLA President Nanda Gurungju, New South Wales Deputy Coordinator NRLA Sukriti Vattaju. Jamelia Tali Gabriel Ambassador for Women and Children Services I would also like to express gratitude to everyone present at the event and also via Zoom from Interstate for accepting our invitation and being a part of this event Himani Coast Australia envisions working together with the Nepalese community to build strong network Himani Coast Australia is always committed committed to work for Nepal and Nepalese people. Also, I would like to extend appreciation to the hard working team of Himani Coast Australia 
for successfully organizing this fundraising event. Thank you, Reshma Thapaju, General Secretary, Paru Pandeju, Treasurer, Kiran Bhandariju, Spokespersons, Roshan Koiralaju, Public Officials, our advisors, and all the members. We thank our North Sydney League Club catering team as well. On behalf of Himanikos Australia, I would like to thank you everyone and wish you a wonderful weekend. Remember, every child deserves to have clean drinking water, to be well fed and educated. Namaste and thank you. We have some snacks and uh, drinks. Give me $51. Donate oh. card. Oh. Oh.